Hi, people. Um, turns out uh, that when Premier Doug Ford of Ontario called the army into the nursing homes there, um, that that was a really strange uh, thing that he did. Uh, because um, it turns out that the Registered Nurses Association of Ontario um, had a list of over 200 nursing professionals ready and willing to go in, and the government knew this because they were in close connect and close contact. Um, they were just waiting for the word to do this, to send them in. Uh, but the government sat on it and didn't uh, take them up on it uh, until weeks later, so sometime in April, I'll, I'll link to the article uh, below, and it ha furnishes dates and such, such, such. But I'm giving you the essence of of what happened here. So, so they finally did, but only two or three days after that is when they called in the army. So before um, the organization of nurses even had a chance to to uh, deploy them into particular homes, government calls in. As Ford says, we called in the troops, which made a great splash in the news, you know, pictures of army soldiers in fatigues marching into the nursing homes to save the day. So this is pretty weird because it was completely unnecessary. And in fact, Doris Grinspun, who is the CEO of the RNABC, said it was very concerning that they did this. And she was at a loss and was unable to get answers from the government as to why they did this. So it begs the question, what the heck is who Doug Ford is doing whose bidding 